Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jaden. I am a first year dental hygiene student. I am currently on my winter break. I start school one week from tomorrow. I have an exciting day tomorrow. I'm gonna be shadowing one of my friends who just graduated from my dental hygiene program this last May. Other news, I have a exciting package to open from Scrubs and Beyond. They sent me free scrubs to try on and review and I'm so excited. I have tried on so many scrubs throughout the years being a dental assistant and now having to wear them every single day at school. I definitely know if something is good or if it's bad. Here's the package. I have been waiting to open it. I can only wear black scrubs to school. So naturally, I ordered pink. Ooh, they're so soft. They're joggers. So cute. These are officially from Med Couture is the scrub brand, but I got them off of Scrubs and Beyond. So I will link both of those in the description. So tomorrow I will bring you along what it is like to shadow a dental hygienist. I highly recommend that you shadow someone if you're interested in the field. And then I'm also going to be shadowing someone on Monday at a new dental office that I've never been to and I'm really looking forward to that. I've heard so many great things about that other office and so I'm really excited to see what it's like. So I am done with shadowing. I was there for about four and a half hours. I saw four patients and it was really fun. It flew by. I learned so much with each patient. That's the cool thing about dental hygiene is that even though you are basically doing the same thing, depending on if they have a normal cleaning or you know, deep cleaning or, or whatnot, those things pretty much stay the same in terms of how to perform a profi, which is a cleaning, but each patient is so different and each mouth is so different, like each person had their own set of problems and concerns and uh, personalities, and so that's the cool thing about uh, dental hygiene is that while you don't have a lot of variety in what you do, the people that you see are so unique and it's really fun to talk to them. Um, I definitely feel like I'm a people person. I love talking and, and getting to know people. So that was really fun. I also learned a lot of just tips from the hygienist that I shadowed. And something that was also just really cool was seeing how this hygienist that I shadowed she was in my exact spot two years ago and and it's cool to see her manage her own patients and she's confident and at the moment i don't feel that way i am not ready to start cleaning mouths like i can't see myself reaching that point but seeing someone that literally went through the same schooling as me and now is a full-time hygienist and is totally killing it like gives me a, a boost of confidence for sure so yeah now I'm just driving home I get to do some pathology and pharmacology homework because even though the school semester hasn't started my teacher sent out some information to go over because she's like guys if you come to this class not knowing anything at all about these topics you will feel overwhelmed and I believe her I have heard so I've heard that these are like the hardest classes pharmacology pathology and periodontology I've heard they are some of the hardest classes and 
they all get done in the same semester. So I am going to prepare as much as I can and so that I can start the semester off on a good note. Also, thank you husband for buying me something that I can mount my phone to in the car so I don't have to hold it all of the time and be shaky. I wore my new scrub bottoms this whole day and honestly I feel like I'm wearing pajamas like in a good way. <laughs> they are so comfy and so soft and so yeah so 10 out of 10 I'm really happy with these scrubs and I would definitely buy from them again. But I have um, shadowing again on Monday at a new office and so I will definitely check in again after that. Until then, I'm just gonna keep enjoying my break. So I am back from shadowing at the second office. It's Monday. I was planning on being there for about three hours and then I was there actually closer to five, which is crazy because it absolutely flew by. I learned so much. I shadowed three different hygienists and their office is just so fluid and continuous. Like they are such a great team and it's a beautiful office. The patients were all really kind and yeah, 100% A plus is a great office. One thing that you should do when you are shadowing is just be a sponge. Just ask literally every question that just comes to your mind because these people have lived it. They have all gone to hygiene school. Um, two out of the three hygienists all went to my same program. They know their stuff. And so take advantage of that opportunity and just learn as much as you can. I think this is a great opportunity to see if you can handle being that close to someone's mouth because it's not for everyone. I mean, it doesn't bother me at all, but you just don't know. You can watch YouTube videos. You won't actually be able to experience a smell or breath or saliva or blood. I love making new connections and putting myself out there so that dentists know that I'm a hygiene student and that I'm trying to be proactive and learn as much as I can. Thank you again for watching my video. I start school in two days, so wish me luck on this new semester and I will see you next time.